celebrate finishing and have a nice peach nectar. I don't know what it's going to taste like. Let's see. Like peach juice. Not surprised. It's a good time. We are down here in Tokyo today. <clears throat> and I am going to show you something pretty cool. Sensoji Shrine. So we're just at this park right now, but I have an hour of buses to go catch to get there. So let's get after it. Break time adventure, baby. All right, let's walk through the gate here. This is cool. We've got the gods on the sides. I think they're called cannon. So this is Sensoji Temple, Buddhist temple. And I believe there's around 80 stores in this shopping street. It's very famous. Um, plenty of cool stuff. Other people taking videos. Buy a kimono. Anyway, we're getting next to the gate. Five-story pagoda. This is nice. If you can't tell, I got a new camera. So hopefully the videos get better from here on out. So this is Sensoji, and we have <laughs> giant five-story pagoda. Very cool, very tall. These are fortune-telling um, boxes, so where that woman is shaking, you get a stick with a number on it, and then you hand it into the store person, and uh, they'll give you your fortune. That's what these people are doing at the rainbow things. These are shrine tokens called omamori and each one is like a, a prayer wrapped in a very cool cloth um, covering that are prayed on uh, by the buddhist monks and it's like an offering to the temple i have a ton of them Very cool. Definitely recommend coming here. This is the oldest and most important shrine in Tokyo, according to Wikipedia. Now let's go explore some other places. Let's get some food. Just walking around is fun. Like, there's this cool street. Found this other shrine I'm gonna walk up to. Really close. Wow. This area's got lots of little parks and things. Cool bell. Oh, this must be the New Year's bell. So on New Year's Eve, I think, uh, on New Year's Day, I guess, at midnight, they ring it a hundred and one times, I believe. So it's the bell of time from the 17th century. That's cool. All oh, this is cool. This is the pagoda. Lots of, lots of cool stuff around here. These shops. Look at this little Godzilla guy. Awesome. Takigori. Bakeries. Ooh. 
lady selling alcohol. It's cool. You can take a cart ride here. I've never done it. I want to. Some of the shrines are on big hills, temples, and I feel bad for the guys who'd have to pull me up one of those shrines in a cart. <laughs> Might be worth it though. Ooh, matcha beer, ice cream, coffee, everything. Everything's green tea flavored. That looks good. Ooh, some ramen. More ice cream. Yeah. We're all tourists today. Last time I was here was Christmas, two years ago, before Corona. And I was here with my sister, and a bird pooped on me. It was awesome. Greatest time of my life. Oh, listen to the cicadas. So loud. Just like in anime. They really do sound like that all the time when it's hot. Ooh, great wave of Kanagawa, the blue one. Famous. That's from a series of paintings done by, I think, Hokusai? It's like 300 views of Mount Fuji. So every picture you did for that series has Mount Fuji in it somewhere. Gotta watch out for Mr. Ninja up there. He's gonna come and steal my ninja secrets. I don't know. I don't have any ninja secrets. This is Hoppy Street. All of these are restaurants on the sides. Side note, I was walking and some guy gave me a fan. And it's really nice because I'm super hot. Ooh, it's nice, y'all. Fan the camera. You guys feel the cool air? Because I don't. It's so hot. But yeah, all these places. These are all little air conditions and stuff. It's pretty cool. Lots of fried chicken at that place. This looks like, they're like little side dishes, they're izakayas, so like small Japanese bar type things, but they're all outside. At night it's really cool and they're all lit up and stuff. Really cool place. They also have all these cool food stands that you can get, like pineapple, corn, fried chicken, yakitori. They're pretty good. They're like festival foods. One of the other cool things about this place as you can see the sky tree. That's for another day. But such a cool view. Main gate, one more time. Yeah, pagoda. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. One more stroll through the shops of Sensoji Temple. Very cool. Prince. <laughs> Ukiyo-e, which is woodblock prints. Those are the old style Japanese art things that I like. I have a couple in my house of the real ones that are printed um, from Sapporo, actually. My friends got them for me. Ice cream. Shirts. Hello Kitty in a kimono. I need that. Of course, you can see the shrine gate in the front. Ooh, ice cream sounds good. They have shaved ice here. They call it cocky gory. It's really good. I've seen a lot of people with it in different flavors. Ooh, I want some. I need a new set of chopsticks. Mine are all 100 yen or one dollar. Buy some nice lacquered ones. Nice fan to hang up on the walls, always a good gift. Or a dinosaur painting. Super Japanese, -y. I like it.
Well, as we get to the end of the road, quite literally, the end of Sensu G. Just want to say thank you for watching. Break time adventure going under the thing. It's been a blast. I hope you like this video. Like and subscribe, please. Watch my Snapchats. Plenty more stuff where, plenty more things that I make. <laughs> Peace. As I was walking away, the shrine is right next to the famous golden poop. Nice. Had to end it with ramen at Ichiran. Yeah.